First meter we'll look at is a Wavetech 2015. It's currently set into amps and DC and by pressing the min max button we can get it to read hold max up here. The second one let's just uh, clear that it was already set. This is a Wavetech 2020 and we use these buttons to go through and we want to find the peak click the tick and then it will be set to measure the peak and it continues to beep just while it's measuring the background level and the third one is a Wavetech 2030 and again this uses the same so let's just clear that and it's already set to peak and below that we're just going to use um, a Hewlett Packard or an Agilent 6632B power supply um, and that will pulse on and off to give us a input signal. I'm monitoring that on a oscilloscope that's just measuring the voltage coming out with the power supply. The voltage is uh, going through a big 25 ohm resistor uh, so it should give us about half an amp out. So there, apologies for the, the reflection in the background, there is a fresh signal. Now if we go and look at what's on the meters, now I forgot to reset the 2030, that one I did set and it's showing 469 milliamps, this one is showing 460, so let's reset these, so that's back to holding max, back to zero and should be back to measuring next. So we're now back to measuring max. Um, the fluke, which was the last one, um, unfortunately that hasn't got a max measurement feature on it. They do create while they're waiting or while they're continuing just to measure the background max or just picking up some noise. Um, each time they go up another point, one of a milliamp or so, they do create a, another an annoying beep. But let's just uh, let's just give it another short pulse. So there's another short pulse. And this time we've got 466.8, 474.7, 0.46. So the 2015 does the job, not particularly accurately. Um, and both the 2020 and the 2030 do do a, a good job. In terms of other features, um, on the 2020 and 2030 both are good to a thousand volts um, they have both got capacitance um, measurement um, they have both got period or both measure voltage uh, true RMS um, and standard um, I'll need to check the specs to find out the detail on the accuracy. I suspect that the 2030 is uh, just a bit more accurate.